What is going on guys and girls? RZRM here. They were playing some more GTA 5. We are going to try and help Lamar. Why'd you invite this stoolie, huh? We want Lamar to be rescued, not sold to the feds. Give it a rest, asswipe. Man, what y'all two shut the fuck up? Now let's take a look at this place, man. Lester said this was some type of big weed store spot. This place is crawling with ballers, you know? Now me and you, we don't mind the old gang warfare, but suede box over there. <laughs> yeah. Tell Trevor I said bite me. Man, I said shut up. Now I see the weed, but where the fuck is Lamar? Oh shit, there he go. You know, tell Trevor I'm gonna be up on this hill with my rifle. I don't want to be anywhere around him when he fucks this whole thing up. Classic. Classic, huh? He's already planning his escape. Oh, fuck. Well, he has the, his escape. I run towards it. He already has an escape route, but already has... What's that? Getting to an, an assault position. Um, I saw a few possible entry here. points when I got here. One, the front entrance on the right there. It's the most direct way in and most likely the heaviest. Two, down the hill to my left. There's a bulldozer there. Might be able to use it in the assault. Three, the other side from me. By the railroad. Should be possible to avoid the worst of it that way. But I won't be able to cover you. Alright, thanks. Don't shoot and don't get too close. We don't want them to know we're here until we want them to know we're here. Ah, uh, okay. You're the expert in springing attacks on the unsuspecting. Okay, I'm gonna go to the front. Because I've got my combat MG and carbon rifle. I'm Confirm Trevor's position. Direct assault. Alright, my turn to move. Alright, I'm at the spot. When the time comes, I'll do what I can from up here. I reckon our best shot is coming at him from two different directions. Alright, I'll take that on board. Of course. The one with the bulldozer. They coming for us right now. What? Okay, I'm going to assault them from here. Yeah, I was about to switch to Trevor. Can't see anybody, so we might have to rush at them. Whoa, 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 whoa! Not this. Yeah. Well, I shouldn't have switched to Trevor. He was in the worst position ever. I mean, you don't advance on, until you know that there's nobody behind you. I'm gonna find a way in. Yeah, we do want Trevor here with this with this MG. So we don't want them to see us again. Which probably means we don't want them to hear us. And where's the bulldozer? Oh right there. 
Nice. Okay. I'm gonna help you. You are fine because I'm coming here. Where's the dude? Oh, right here is the dude. I knew we could save Trevor like this. However, I am taking heavy fire. And there are lots of guys there. There's him right there. You got a friend of ours. So where's Lamar? Chamberlain gangster families for life, motherfuckers. Lamar, Lamar. Shit, sniper. Hold tight. I might be able to get it. Sniper, all right. Okay. There's Trevor. All right, that's enough. We're going to switch to Trevor. What's with Franklin? Let us go! Oh, Franklin's taking damage. Come on, there's only one guy here. 
as I took care of them. Lamar back to his house. This was intense. So Stretch set him up. Okay. <laughs> he probably lost the car. This the hood you talking about. Maybe you forgot since you've been uh, bettering yourself sitting in that house on the hill looking down on the animals of South Central and shit. Man, you know it ain't like that. Do I, my nigga? Because that's the way it looked to me. I'm making the best out of what I'm giving. You know what I'm talking about? I ain't in some type of mentorship program. The only mentor I got. And we gonna do something about that, dog. Trust me. Man, I ain't got people teaching me that white collar crime shit. Ain't shit changed for me, and you ain't helping. Ain't helping? What the fuck you called it? Me? Yeah, we definitely helped you. You were almost dead. We all came up here to help. The unholy fucking trinity. Ballers beware when these fools rolling together. Oh, we're back these here. Fools rolling together. Jealous of Michael and Trump? What happened to me and you fucking shit up? Four gangsters, nigga. So I shouldn't have called him, right? And I was doing everything in my power to make sure you wasn't clapping. I can make sure I ain't clapping. Clearly you can't. Next time, homie, don't come. And you matter of fact, if you do come, don't bring them, dude. Man, look, let's not talk. Fuck, man. Let's not talk next time. Next time, don't get your ass in the situation, all right? It's the hood, Frank. That's what happens in the hood. No, the fuck it don't. Not for everyone. I'm one of them dudes that it happens to. Man, you gonna tell me what was going on back there? Hood shit, homie. That's the shit that's different from the country club shit your overpaid ass is presently accustomed to. Man, stress put us on this shit, man. Man, we gonna get on his ass. Man, fuck that, homie. Look like I give a shit. Nigga, I give a shit. Stress do what he do. Niggas want me dead, be dead themselves. I ain't gonna overreact to shit. Overreact? Man, that nigga stress tried to get you killed, nigga. That's right. The hood. I'm still here, ain't I? Just. You show Stress knew they was gonna book me? Yeah, nigga, Stress knew. Everybody knew Stress knew. Tanisha knew Stress knew, and she don't even come around the fucking hood no more. Damn, that nigga Stress janky like that? Man, you don't see this? Miss Stress been screwing us from the start. Like from back in the day? From like the other day, dawg. Since after we went to the recycling place and D and them ballers try to take us down. But Stretch put in the work on D. Yeah, man, that's survival. Remember how angry his ass got? Especially with you bringing him into this shit? I, I, but tell me this though. If Stretch was fucking with your boy LD, why he set us up with the deal for the brick in the first place? He go off and make peace with the ballers, come back, and then put us on the lick on Grove Street. Man, you remember Grove Street? That brick was drywall. Ripping us off was probably Stretch's ideal anyway. Damn, you think so? It makes sense, don't it? Man, I ain't knowing, man, maybe. Man, Stretch got in with the ballers when he was inside. Played us as marks, dog, but a bunch of them got booked. So now they gotta come back at us. So stress sends you out there where they doing a good deal. Then you show up and save the day. Yeah, thankfully. Man, it wouldn't even be the same if your boy LD wasn't out here getting in the shit. And FC wasn't getting him out of it. Know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Man, I don't know. 
That shit was fun, nigga. Don't tell me you didn't enjoy scrapping like we did back in the day. It ain't back in the day no more, dawg. But it felt like it was. Okay, fool. It was fun saving your useless ass one more fucking time. There you go. That wasn't too hard. <laughs> you should have seen your face when I came in. You was like, shit, shit, shit. Hey, shit, man. Oh, bullshit, nigga. <laughs> you better check them drawers, homie. You probably shit at yourself. Fuck you, man. I don't care if I die. It's a compliment if they send an army after a nigga. They only send like two of the little homies to get you. Nigga, you didn't look like they was paying you no compliment, nigga. Must have just caught a glimpse of your ugly ass. Nigga, you think I'm some angel come to take your ass somewhere you never going to. You pray to your white man God, homie. I'm going to the Great Plain Beyond where the buffalo keep on roaming and the little squall bitches want me to nut on their face all day. Bitch, please. Lamar just doesn't understand that he should follow Franklin. He thinks he's better. And it's gonna cost him a lot, if not his life. And we crashed into this horrible car. You can't even control it, it goes to the left. Get in here, man. Quickly, I needed a faster car and one without broken tires or shot at in order to escape the cops. Damn it. Now I got the cops on us. Helicopter. That's not good. They are going to corner us here. Come on! Okay, that was way more than I could have taken. Idiot switching lanes like this, and our cops who can't see us but who got us. Hey Lamar, stop shooting! You got us! Two stars instead of one. And now we have a chopper on us for some reason, although we should have only had more cops. Okay, nice. We lost the cops again, which is good. Now we have to go back there to drive Lamar home. Oh, this is for trains. Okay, here we are. Back on the road. Everything's okay. Good, we saved him and drove him back home. Good. So I guess I guess if we learned this, nigga don't think it ain't no fun to be half fucking with the homies, nigga, you feel me, my nigga? 
<laughs> yeah, I guess you can look at it like that. Hey, but on some real shit, my nigga, uh, you know your nigga out here doing BAD, man. Why don't you slide me a few dollars or something? You know what I'm talking about? It's hard out here to say. Oh, shit, my nigga, that's nothing. Shit, nigga, I know you done went all Illuminati and shit, you know what I'm saying? Leaving the street niggas in the back. But damn, man, uh, way to keep a nigga down, my nigga. I mean, thank you, I guess. Payment for all the work a nigga put in for you getting them cars and shit, you know what I'm talking about? Give a nigga just enough money to get him a little 40 ounce in the bucket of chicken on the way to the poor house, huh? Man, don't be like that, dawg. Cause number one, I never got paid for them motherfucking cars. Number two, I saved your motherfucking ass. No matter how many times you and that tiny motherfucking brain of yours to try to get us killed, I saved you, dawg. What are you supposed to, my nigga? I thought we was homies for life. Me too, but I thought we was trying to get out of this bullshit. You live in a fantasy, homie. The best thing you can hope for is a big turn off of your motherfucking funeral. Nigga, ain't nobody coming to your funeral. What? Man, what about all the motherfucking times I saved your life, homie? What about that? Oh, thank you, homie. Thanks for leaving your nigga in the backfield. You know what, my nigga? If your ass can just act civilized, you would get some work. But instead, you want to be this gang-banging, mad-dogging asshole. Oh, my bad, Mr. Gold Card. Excuse me, sir. Thank you for helping out a post street nigga like me, sir. You can go now, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nigga, who you think I am, nigga? Fuck you, Lamar. Nah, fuck you, F, nigga. I thought we was homies, nigga. But that's some shit that just got past you, my nigga. You know what, dawg? If something good comes up, I hit my dude, man. Chill out, all right? Yeah, whatever, nigga. You just hit me when you find out what the true concept of friendship is, nigga. We came from the sandbox together. I know that. I got you, dog. If something good come up, I got you. Yeah, whatever, nigga. I'm in a turf, nigga, if you remember where that is. Oh! What's up, player? Hello, Franklin. Man, I don't know y'all. We done, Hey, man. we ain't done yet, homie. Not yet. Nearly. Man, what the fuck y'all want me to do? Kill the president? Fuck his wife or something? Or invade some fucking country? No, no. Something more sensible. Something that's gotta be done. Hey. When the timing's right, you're gonna take old Trevor and put him out the pasture. Oh, me? Michael will be sensible, but Trevor... Trevor won't be. Trevor is a liability that none of us can afford. Man, Trevor saved you. He saved both y'all asses. And it's unfortunate. Hey, when we give you the word, you're gonna do this thing. Man, get Michael to do it. Me and Trevor cool, dog. Michael can't do it. Trevor won't let him near. That's why it's up to you, homie. We are not doing that. Hey, who is that? Nobody. Don't worry about it, nigga. Hey. Lost an ass, nigga. We are not killing Trevor. Lamar down. 75%. Mission time and accuracy. Okay, minus fifty dollars. Did we give Lamar fifty dollars? Is that all? F dog, so my dog's not like a complete asshole. I'm going to the premiere of his movie Church Raw. I'm gonna meet him at Pawn Sons by so we can get a tux. Then next up is red carpet. Swag. Let's call Jimmy. We should hang out sometime. This is James DeSantis' personal line. If you've received my resume by email and would like to discuss how my combination of street smarts and book knowledge can improve your business, please leave a message. Okay, so he's not gonna answer. Now, what do we want to do? I mean, we gave Lamar only $50 of all those money that we have. How much money do we have? Wow, cash deposit. Downtown Capolito Hospital. Wow, we got a lot of money. You could have given him more than that. But he... Whoa, what was that? I wanna shoot this part. Uh, nah, it's not gonna fall. This, you see this little part of the windshield? I wanna shoot it down, but nah, it's not gonna work. Whoa, I just shot the traffic light there. Huh, <laughs> I didn't know you could do that. Anyway... Uh, I don't know what we should do now. 
Oh, a microvision just appeared. Which is nice, so I will see you there in the next episode.